Yes, I'm back. Yes, I'm not a dead YouTuber, and yeah. That's your old fellow Ivan the Stonks Master. <laughs> so, yeah. I haven't been uploading because the school and school sucks ass, and that's pretty much it. Anyways, today we're going to be talking about why carnivorous animals shouldn't be the portrayed as the bad guys. So, yeah. Now, <coughs> for you snowflakes out there and you dumbass intellectuals, animals, some animals need me to survive. That's not, that's a common thing. That's a common thing, you know. Because we humans need me to survive, okay? We have carnivorous teeth for a reason. We're omnivores. We have blunt and sharp teeth for tearing into flesh and biting through carrots. If you, you can't live off a vegan diet, okay? Like, you need meat, okay? Meat gives you protein and strength. Vegan, the freaking plants, um, they just help you poop better. And some other stuff. Like they help some aspects of your body, you know? Yeah. Basically, plants just doesn't... Plants just prevent constipation. That's it. Like, I, I'm wondering how the vegan teacher hasn't killed over and just died and kicked the bucket yet. Like, she's so freaking skinny and frail. It makes fucking... Oh my god. There was, yeah, it makes a fucking piece of paper look buff compared to her. I don't fucking know at this point, man. I swear. But anyways, meat eating animals need meat to survive. Okay, that's just a common fact. You can't help it. It's just mother nature. <sighs> I don't know why you guys don't understand. It's a fucking animal. Okay, it can't make its own choices. Okay, it didn't choose to live like this. It doesn't, it didn't choose the fact that it needed me to survive, okay? It's just nature, man. So, yeah. Now, in my animal biases video, I explained why, you know, some, some animals are just treated unfairly compared to others. Yep. Yep. Motherfucker. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but anyways. Anim animals are just... <laughs> oh my god. Animals just need to survive, okay? They just need to survive. Okay. I'm just so... I'm just losing brain cells because of these people. Now, you've seen those animal rescue videos of, like, people saving a helpless prey item from a carnivorous animal. Like, there's a literal video of where a freaking rabbit gets caught by a hawk. And this old-ass man just... He has a freaking beer belly. He goes, like... And he grabs the hawk... No, he actually just grabs the hawk with his fucking meaty ass hands when he uses to eat 10 Big Macs a day and two, 12 packs of beer. He then grabs it, separates the, the rabbit, you know, puts the rabbit on the ground and just, uh, he's just like, yeah, he just lets it go to the hawk. The hawk is like, man, fuck this shit, I'm out. Like, why would you interfere with nature? Like, now... If you guys still don't believe me that this shit happens, search up her videos of herons. Yes, I made a video of herons of why you should not give them the hate that they, they, they fucking don't deserve. <laughs> For example, like, search up her blue herons on YouTube. And the first video you'll probably see is that blue heron eating a cute, woodsy, woodsy duckling. <sighs> yeah. 
You'll probably think, oh, oh, no, no, I want to save the duckling. I just rip apart the heron's neck to save the fucking duckling. Shut up, snowflake. You clicked on the video, goddammit. <clears throat> now, cute animals can be just as mean as the carnivores, okay? Yeah. Yeah. Like, herbivorous animals, like herbivore animals, can just be as dangerous as a fucking meat-eating animal. Even worse than a meat-eating animal. A meat-eating animal at least has the logic to understand that if he messes up one time, he won't, there's no going back. He's fucking dead. Now, there's a saying out there saying... Let's say, there's a saying out there. It's like, there's a tiger and a deer who's running for their life. And you'll probably answer the deer because it's an innocent animal. But no, it's actually both of them because the tiger needs to hunt the deer by running towards it and catching it and ripping open his jugular. While the deer has to run away so he doesn't get freaking raped by the tiger. Viciously, oh my god. Yeah. Huh? You get what I'm trying to say here? Both are running for their life, okay? Yeah. You get what I'm fucking saying here? Predatory animals just need me to survive. And if you need more examples, I'll give you some. In the link in the description, you'll find two links. One link will lead to an anim my animal bias video, and I explain why why animals, if certain animals, are treated unfairly in society. While the other one is an animation of a T Rex and a Triceratops, and it explains what very well wh on why carnivores shouldn't be treated as badly. Now on to social media, and the uh, wicked film industry. Now, if you watch any animal-based films, you'll know that most of the time, the predator is portrayed as a bad guy. Don't believe me? Look at this. The Lion King. Scar is a lion. They're a carnivores. Bad guy. Stuart Little, the fucking peregrine falcon right there, is a bad guy. Di Disney's dinosaur. Now, that, that motherfucker is a bad The Carnotaurus is a bad guy. Gor Gorgon. From Walking with Dinosaurs 3D from 2014. Yeah, remember Gorgon? Gor the Gorgosaurus? Yeah, Gorgon. And what else? Um, The Jungle Book. Shere Khan the Tiger. I named at least five villains that were in five movies that they were portrayed as the bad guy. The Predator was portrayed by, by the as a bad guy. Well, I mean, some of the, the, the carnivores are portrayed as good guys. Like fucking Mowgli the Bear. Or fucking... Bag Hero the Panther. I don't fucking know at this point. Holy shit. What else? What other movies are out there? P portray the carnivores as the bad guys. Um. I think that's it. I think that's fucking it. I think that's it. To be honest. What? They're leaving out the real... But... You know who's the real bad guys here? Humans. Humans are the real bad guys here. <coughs> yep, they're the real bad guys. Yep. I'm not joking. Humans are the most despicable and dumb ass fucking thing ever. And they make me lose humanity with every Twitter post they fucking post. <sighs> they, everything about humans are fucking wrong. They're just, it's just fucking insane um, how humans have succeeded this far into history and engraved it into the fucking text. <sighs> so in conclusion, predatory animals shouldn't be considered bad shouldn't be considered a bad thing, okay? They're just trying to survive. 
so anyways, yeah. Also, there's going to be a third link, a third special link on this special occasion, too. Anyways, I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye, and subscribe if you want to.